Imagine standing on a vast flat plain, the ground stretches out endlessly in every direction and you feel a sense of infinite space around you. The horizon seems to be the boundary of your world, the farthest point you can see. But what lies beyond that horizon? What mysteries and wonders are hidden just out of sight? You can see to the horizon in every direction. As you turn in a full circle, the horizon remains a constant, distant line, marking the edge of your visible world. It's a reminder that our perception is limited, confined to what our eyes can see. This is your visible horizon, the limit of what you can see. Beyond it, the world continues, but it remains hidden from your view. This concept of a horizon is not just limited to our everyday experiences, it extends to the cosmos as well. Now, imagine that the Earth is not flat but curved. From space, we can see the curvature of our planet, a beautiful blue sphere floating in the vastness of space. This curvature means that our horizon is not a straight line but a curve, and it changes as we move. Even though you can't see beyond your horizon, you know there's more Earth beyond it. This understanding comes from our knowledge of the planet's shape and size. Similarly, our understanding of the universe extends beyond what we can directly observe. The observable universe is like that horizon. When we look up at the night sky, we see countless stars and galaxies, each a tiny part of the vast cosmos. But just as with the horizon on Earth, there is much more beyond what we can see. It's the limit of how far we can see into the cosmos, not the limit of the cosmos itself. Our telescopes and instruments allow us to peer deep into space but they can only take us so far. The true extent of the universe remains a mystery, hidden beyond our cosmic horizon. Our cosmic horizon is defined by the distance that light has had time to travel to us since the Big Bang. Light traveling at an incredible speed carries with it the history of the universe, allowing us to look back in time as we gaze into the depths of space. The Big Bang was about 13.8 billion years ago. This monumental event marked the beginning of the universe as we know it, setting in motion the expansion and evolution of everything we see today. So, you might think the observable universe is a sphere with a radius of 13.8 billion light-years. This sphere represents the maximum distance that light has traveled to reach us, creating a cosmic boundary of sorts. But the universe is not static, it's expanding. This expansion means that the distances between galaxies are increasing, and the universe is growing larger over time. This expansion means that the objects we see at the edge of the observable universe are much farther away now than they were when they emitted the light we see. The light from these distant galaxies has traveled for billions of years, crossing the vast expanse of space to reach us. That light has been traveling for billions of years and during that time, the universe has been stretching. This stretching of space means that the light has covered an even greater distance than we might initially think, revealing the dynamic and ever-changing nature of the cosmos. To understand the scale of the observable universe, we need to grasp the concept of a light year. A light year is a fundamental unit of measurement in astronomy, and it helps us comprehend the vast distances between celestial objects. Imagine the universe as a vast ocean, and light years as the miles that measure the distance between islands in this cosmic sea. A light year is not a measure of time, but of distance. Specifically, it is the distance that light travels in one year. This might sound simple, but the implications are profound. Light, the fastest thing in the universe, becomes our cosmic ruler. It's the distance that light travels in one year. To put it into perspective, light travels at an incredible speed, approximately 300,000 kilometers per second, or 186,000 miles per second. This speed is so immense that it can be hard to visualize. Light travels at an incredible speed, approximately 300,000 kilometers per second, or 186,000 miles per second. This means that in just one second, light can travel around the Earth seven and a half times. Imagine a beam of light racing around our planet completing multiple laps in the blink of an eye. That's fast enough to circle the Earth over seven times in a single second. This astonishing speed is what makes light such a powerful tool for measuring the vast distances in space. Over the course of a year this speed allows light to cover an almost unimaginable distance. Over a year, light covers a distance of about 9.46 trillion kilometers, or 5.88 trillion miles. That's one light year. To put this into perspective, if you were to travel at the speed of light, it would take you a year to cover this distance. This unit of measurement helps astronomers understand the scale of the universe. When we look at distant galaxies, we're not seeing them as they are right now. 
Instead, we're looking back in time. The light from these galaxies has traveled for millions or even billions of years to reach us. This means that the images we see are snapshots of the past. We're seeing them as they were billions of years ago when the light from those galaxies first began its journey towards us. This journey of light allows us to peer into the history of the universe, giving us a glimpse of what it looked like long before our planet even existed. The light's long journey is a testament to the vastness and wonder of the cosmos. The universe is expanding, and it's not just the galaxies moving apart from each other. The space between the galaxies is expanding too. Imagine baking a loaf of raisin bread. As the dough rises, the raisins move farther apart, even though they're not moving within the dough itself. The space between them is expanding. Similarly, the expansion of the universe stretches the very fabric of space-time. This stretching affects the light traveling through it. As light waves travel through expanding space, their wavelengths get stretched out. This is called redshift. Measuring the size of the observable universe is a complex task that has fascinated scientists for centuries. The vastness of space and the sheer number of celestial objects make this a monumental challenge. It involves observing distant objects, measuring their redshift, and then accounting for the expansion of the universe. Redshift is a key concept in this process, as it indicates how much the wavelength of the light from a distant object has been stretched due to the expansion of the universe. Astronomers use various techniques including observing distant supernovae, which are exploding stars. These supernovae act as cosmic lighthouses providing valuable data on the rate of expansion of the universe. Another crucial method involves measuring the cosmic microwave background radiation, the faint glow left over from the Big Bang. This radiation provides a snapshot of the early universe, allowing scientists to infer its size and structure. The afterglow of the Big Bang known as the cosmic microwave background radiation is a treasure trove of information. By studying its minute fluctuations, scientists can learn about the universe's composition, age, and rate of expansion. These observations have led to the current estimate of the observable universe's size, a diameter of about 93 billion light years. This mind-boggling figure represents the limit of what we can see, given the finite speed of light and the age of the universe. That's a number so vast it's hard to comprehend. To truly grasp the enormity of the observable universe, we need to use analogies and comparisons. To put it into perspective, if the Milky Way galaxy were the size of a quarter, a small coin that fits in the palm of your hand, the observable universe would be about the size of the United States. This comparison helps illustrate just how vast and expansive our universe truly is, stretching our imagination to its limits. Section 5. Beyond the Observable. The observable universe is just that, what we can observe, but what lies beyond our cosmic horizon. We can't see past it, but that doesn't mean there's nothing there. The universe may extend infinitely beyond what we can see. Or it might be finite, but much larger than the observable universe. We simply don't know. It's also possible that our universe is just one of many universes in a vast multiverse. Each universe might have its own set of physical laws and constants. Section 6. The Expanding Mystery. The expansion of the universe is one of the most profound discoveries in astronomy. It has profound implications for the fate of the universe. If the expansion continues to accelerate as current observations suggest, the universe may eventually end in a big rip. In this scenario the expansion would become so rapid that it would tear apart galaxies, stars and even atoms. However, other possibilities exist. The expansion could slow down, eventually coming to a halt. Or it could even reverse, leading to a big crunch, where the universe collapses back in on itself. Section 7. Unveiling the Invisible. Adding to the mystery of the universe's size and fate is the fact that most of the universe is invisible to us. We can only see the matter that emits or absorbs light, which makes up only about 5% of the universe. The remaining 95% is made up of dark matter and dark energy. We can't see dark matter directly but we know it exists because of its gravitational effects on visible matter. Dark energy is even more mysterious. It's thought to be responsible for the accelerating expansion of the universe. Section 8. A Universe of Possibilities. The study of the universe is a journey into the unknown. Every new discovery raises more questions than it answers. 
the observable universe is just a tiny glimpse into the vastness of the cosmos. It's humbling to realize how much we don't know but it's also incredibly exciting. The universe is full of mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Section 9. A Never-Ending Quest The quest to understand the universe is a never-ending one. New telescopes and instruments are constantly being developed, allowing us to peer deeper into space and further back in time. As our understanding of the universe grows, so too does our appreciation for its beauty, its complexity, and its sheer immensity. The universe is a vast and mysterious place, and we are just beginning to explore its wonders.